Gary, this is our Perdomo Patriarch. This is uh, this has been a project we've been trying to put in effect the last four years uh, after the death of my father. And this is in, in remembrance to my father. And this is uh, arguably one of the finest cigars in the world, in my opinion. Uh, traditional shapes. We have six shapes and sizes. We have a Lonsdale, a Corona Extra, a Robusto, a Toro. And if you look to your left, we have a Torpedo and a Churchill. Um, this was a blend that my father really enjoyed. More of a medium to full body blend. All Cuban seed tobaccos, including the wrappers, the binders, and the fillers. And we have two different wrappers. We have the Corojo wrapper that my father really enjoyed. Mm -hmm. and a dark Maduro wrapper that's Cuban seed that we ferment. And what's neat about this particular cigar is a lot of these wrappers, which the fermentation process was started by my father, so it's a it's a really, really? special cigar for us. So they're, yeah. they're long age? They're very long age. Yeah. A lot of these cigars are over four and five years of tobacco. So, and it was something that we wanted to do in, 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 his, in his name. So it's a special product. People ask me, well, well tell me about it. You know, it's, it, I love my dad. It's, uh, it's really, truly the best thing that, that, that Perdomo's made. I'm proud to, to offer it to, to everybody. Here. Can you compare it in any way to like you know the Habano blend or, or no? Or I, it's, 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 it, it's really a different. It really stands by itself. It's uh, it's the echelon of the Silvio. I think it's very well priced, between six and nine dollars. I'd venture to say for a super super premium, it's one of the most affordable cigars in the marketplace today. And Gary, we're showcasing the Perdomo Reserve 10th anniversary. Um, since the brand's been out for 10 years, we decided to, to give it its, its anniversary edition. If you look over here, we have the, the Perdomo Reserve Champagne, which has been one of the hottest sellers for, for Perdomo cigars. We like that cigar. Uh, we, repack, we repacked the cigars. We kept the blend on this particular cigar the same because of, of how it's selling. People really enjoy this particular brand. If we look over to the left, this is our new Cuban Criollo. Completely re-engineered, re-blended, a nice full-bodied cigar, 100% Cuban seed tobacco, all grown in our, our three different uh, stages or three different farms in Nicaragua, in the, in the Jalapa Valley, the Condega Valley, and the Esteli Valley. A super, super refined premium cigar that's, that has a lot of flavor. The new Perdomo Reserve uh, Maduro 10th Anniversary, again, Gary, 100% Nicaraguan. The wrappers have three fermentations to get them to their dark stage, and it's really special because it's all Cuban seed. It's got a nice, sweet finish with a real solid tobacco core of flavor. Uh, I would say it's three quarters, medium to full body. Um, it's been selling extremely well, and you'd, you'd ask me how the show's going. The show has been phenomenal for us. We surpassed last year, yeah, believe it or not, yesterday. And I'd like to show you the new Perdomo Square. I definitely like to see that. Gary, this is our Perdomo Square. This is an oldie but goodie that we brought back due to popular demand, people emailing us, writing us. Uh, we retired this brand five years ago solely for the reason we were running low on a certain wrapper that we were using for it. Then I had to take one and I, I ended up giving Perdomo Reserve Camera its due. Um, this brand's got 90 points in Cigar Ficcionado. It's a fantastic brand. What we did is we actually dropped the pricing on it and re-engineered the packaging where now it comes in boxes of 40. Wow. Uh, Perdomo Square has four shapes and this is the Maduro we show you. As we walk over here, <clears throat> you get to see the natural that comes in the red bands. And we call it the Perdomo Square Limited Edition for 2000, 2008. But we think the brand is going to be jumping off the shelves. We've taken a tremendous amount of orders on it. And we're, we're real proud of the brand. And, uh, and we're just we're, we're moving up in the right place. We'd like to thank all you, the consumers, for supporting the Perdomo Cigars. Oh, you're welcome. It's a very consistent product. Thank you very let, much. Let me, what, are you, what are your thoughts about the, um, the industry in general? Like, what's, what's the vibe you're getting in terms of the future? And well, all I can like do that. is I can speak for us. We've been super busy the whole show. Um, we're blessed. Uh, we continue growing. Like I said, we're, we're, we're way up from last year, and uh, we continue growing in the right fashion. And but we're, we're really strong in establishing our brands, and we're strong in establishing our, our blends and the consistency. And we want to keep the product as refined as possible for our consumers. But at the same token, the hard challenge is keeping the pricing as reasonable as we've kept. It's been a challenge, but we've, we've continued doing that. And we're proud of it. Do you consider yourself a, a boutique label? I've been talking to a lot of you know, manufacturers who, you know, we would call quote unquote boutique labels. I mean, you're, you're, I think you're a little bigger than some of these guys, but where do you, where do you see yourself fitting in? I mean, well, we're, you know, we're, we're still a family driven business. All my family works for the company. I would say we're a little bit bigger than boutique, mm -hmm. but uh, we, we, we have a mantra of, of trying to produce the best quality product for our consumers. We don't run assembly lines. We try to, we try to run, we try to run everything, you know, just 
just by you know a lot of attention to detail and trying to get the right things by our consumers. So even though we're a large size company, we still run it like a small family business. And the number one priority for us is our consumers. All right. Well, thanks very much. Thank you, Gary. Appreciate it. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you.